What's up guys? Welcome back to another Walking Dead where we are going to now run the two seasons or two episodes together. It's gonna be a long one, but I want to get this one finished. So four and five, same video. Let's get it. It's gonna be like a little premiere. You know how they throw on a little bit of a longer show with a premiere so this will be like our premiere but an ending premiere so it's a little bit different but it's not a huge deal i'm kind of looking ex looking forward to it i think we got captured the last time i checked um but it's probably gonna do like a flashback for us i'm predicting it's probably gonna be a three-hour video previously on the walking dead You monsters! <laughs> You're a piece of work, you know that? Oh yeah, we're gonna kill him, for sure. He's dead. He's donezo. Fucking Garcias! <sighs> You, you, you shook my goddamn guts out. You, no. Oh, man. Let's let him turn. It's only right. I think I turned my light off. Joan was in on it. We did it on her orders. I'm, I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. We don't need your help. You. Honestly, Richmond would be a sick place to take over. Very strong settlement to have. I'd hold it there, folks. And I'd consider explaining yourselves. Run it as like a single party, like a king, kinda. Where there's no one else involved, because obviously backstabbing is a huge issue in this uh, universe. I asked you to get Kate and Gabe safe, not tuck your tail and run. They were our family, David. How could you? Piece of shit! I'll give you family! Why would they tackle me though? I still don't understand why they would tackle me and not David. I don't even have, I don't even know if I have a gun. I don't think I do. I think I got the bat and that's it. The whole situation has just gone awry to be honest, but it's okay. It's okay. Our plan is to kill off Gabe and kill off David and obviously try to take Richmond for ourselves because, um, Trip's community is blown, so, you know. Oh, this is, oh god, a flashback. Strike one. I'm out of practice, that's all. Yeah, same here. I haven't held a bat since the league booted me. Well, you got all afternoon to get back in your groove. <sighs> oh yeah. Just holding this thing makes me feel better. You doing okay? Uh, I've been wrestling with something. Hey! Hey man, you're Javier Garcia, right? The ball player? Can I get your autograph? <laughs> if you could sign my baseball, that would be so awesome. Not now, kid. Don't disappoint your fans. No, this is supposed to be quality family time. I'm glad they kicked you out. Oh, wow. You were saying? Uh, it can wait. I gotta focus on not embarrassing myself in front of a big baseball star. Right now, I've hit no balls. I know I can do better. Hey. Don't worry about it, man. We're just having fun here, right? Yeah, yeah, we'll see about that. It's 
a pretty rude fucking kid, bro. Swing and a miss! You don't have to start sucking because of me. Does talking like that make you feel better? Yeah, you should try it. <sighs> Son of a bitch! Strike two. Man, knock that shit off. I'm serious. You just talk, talk, talk. It's annoying. Oh, wow. Sorry, David. Look, it's cool you're trying to cheer me up. Really? I still can't believe you actually wanted to come here. If I were in your situation, I'd avoid batting cages forever. Well, thanks for bringing me anyway. I needed the distraction. Things are looking up. Because you stopped screwing around. Next time, we go to the shooting range. I don't really shoot. But I do. And I'm good at it. Ow! Fuck! You gotta shut up! Stupid thing. My arm's throbbing. Oh, come on. Don't be a wuss. <laughs> I used to tell you the same thing. You did? Yeah. Back when we were younger. I remember I showed you how to play this game. Well, let this superstar return the favor. Watch this. Whew. Thought I lost my touch. Oh, please. I'm done. Wow. Dude's so David. fucking angry, bro. All the time. David, what's wrong? Come back. I came here to reconnect. Instead, you just want to show me up. What's going on? David, I, I don't understand. You don't understand because you only think about yourself. And I'm sick of it. It's been that way for years. You've always been looking out for yourself. You tried to help me. Yeah, let me help you. You really want to help? All right. Drive me down to the recruitment office next week. The army? My job sucks. Kate and I fight like cats and dogs. I belong back in the army. I had a purpose there. I had respect. Hey, you know what? Yeah, do what you need to do. The army could be good for you. I was expecting more of an argument. Things between me and Kate have been going downhill for a while. But if I left, it seemed like that would be best for everyone. Oh, yeah. I can't keep pretending this is the life I want. I'm not going to stand in your way. Well, all right then. I'm not going to lie. If I go, it's going to be hard on everyone. Kate may need help from time to time. You can help, right? You won't leave her hanging? I need to know that. In my mind. I'll be there for them, since you won't. If you want to go, you should go. <sighs> Thank you. I really mean it. We good? Yeah. We good. Come on. Let's get out of here. Buy you a beer. I just want him to fuck off. <laughs> He's kind of a dick. I hate him. It's kind of... Had the same temper as my brother as a kid. I let you go. On the road, remember? Can't you help us now? Most I remember it's why I haven't shot you already. Thanks, how I'm helping you. Joan's making a huge mistake. No, you made a mistake when you murdered Lonnie. Hey, everybody just take a breath, all right? I was just trying to tell them and that's your mistake right there. You can't fight everybody. Understand that Joan's not looking for revenge. She just wants order. Cooperation is the name of the game. There's still a way through this, but you've got to let Joan enforce the laws. I know you Richmond folks are a little flexible when it comes to doing what's right. I don't buckle just because it's the easy thing to do. You talk a big game, but talk isn't going to get you out of this mess. You boys want to make it out of here. Just relax and trust in the process. 
trust my foot up your ass. Stupid motherfucker. After I brought you in, after I saved your asses, this is how you treat me. Yep. Betrayal? Lies? David, I'm not your enemy. We have to figure out what to do about Joan. Joan's betrayal wasn't as bad as yours, little brother. Do you have any understanding of what they're doing to me? I'm being set up. And I don't even want to think about what they'll do when they find Kate. I could have found a way to protect all of you. But now? Now you're all on your own. <sighs> you gotta still have some friends here, right? I thought Lonnie was a friend. He turned on me. And you shot him. Any friends you haven't killed, haven't killed you yet. It's everyone out for themselves these days. We wouldn't be in this situation if you paid attention to what Joan was up to. I did my best. I have always done my best. Can't say I never tried. I have always given 100%. Oh yeah? Tell that to Kate. You left her behind once already. Maybe it's time you try a different way. Shut up! Oh. You're dead to me. If we get out of here, you're on your own. I'm through with you. Fucker. Let's go. Typical brothers. Fighting like boys. You bitch. I fucking trusted you! Careful! Don't give him a concussion. I came here to talk, not fight. You're not going to be a problem, are you? I just want a calm discussion between us. If you thought David was a problem, I got news for you. I'm even worse. Oh, please. Well, people had concerns about me coming here after the way you murdered Lonnie, David. But I know what the real danger here is. And you need to hear about it. If you know there's trouble out there, just tell us. I'm getting to it. Those raids were unfortunate, but necessary. The real danger was another long winter. I should have been told about this. David, you remember how many friends we lost last year. I couldn't bear to see it happen again. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna call for a gathering in the square. The people deserve to hear a full explanation of your arrest. And then? Then, you'll be replaced as head of security. No one's above the law, David. Not even you. I know the laws, Joan. You're the one breaking them. Your scheme is gonna blow up in your face. You just wait. I really hope not. I'm responsible for the lives of everyone in this community. You set me up! Everyone's gonna see through your lies. I did what I had to do to keep the people of Richmond safe. They're going to see that. And they'll also see that the biggest threat to them right now is you. Bullshit! I understand you're angry with me, but let's talk about it in private. Bring him with us. Screw this. Gotta get out of here. Oh, we will, Harvey. Don't you fucking stress, brother. Sweet Jim, Morpheus, where are you, bro? No time to rest. <clears throat> okay, well then, why was that even an option? That doesn't look very sturdy. Mm, well, what about this? Oh, let's grab this pipe. You can never know when a pipe like this could come in handy. Guess this was a boy shower. Everything's just well, falling apart. That's about the kind of day I'm having. This chair. Okay, so why did you look at it and then look away like that? Did it bring back memories, bro? Something happened to you? So is this, was this whole thing? No, nah, this must have been locker rooms. Alright, let's see what we can do here. That one locker. Uh, nothing useful here. That one locker was the one I could look at. 
gonna stand on this. Yeah, that's all I would have taken the stool, <laughs> but I'm not gonna get up there from this bench. Well yeah, that's why you take the stool, bro. Forward thinking and shit, you know. I'm gonna take it now. Been a long time since I hit the showers. Oh, and I could use one. Too bad there's no running water in here. Grand wheel. Wait, this place is a fucking filth, filthy cesspool. I wouldn't want to. Look at the walls, bro. It's all mold on the walls. It's disgusting. That's not gonna work. I wasn't expecting it to. <sighs> Locked. I'm not getting out through here. I'm just kind of trying to exhaust my options and see if someone comes. No one's out there. Okay, so that's exhausted. Let's see if there's any options on the window. So you go. Could squeeze through there. Need a way to get on top of those lockers. Okay, so I'm I'm confused as to why I can't pick the stool up. Why can't I can't pick up the stool. There you go. Now we can grab it. Oh come on. Really? It's a little coincidental if you ask me. Well, I'll break it. Javi! Oh, hey. Kate! I wasn't sure how I was going to find you. Then I heard the glass breaking. You're alive. For now, you escaped the guards. Barely. We gotta get you out of here. Take this. Help me pry these bars off. <clears throat> Shit. Give it a push from your side. Why wouldn't you? Just like fucking sitting there hoping she's gonna do everything. Thanks, Kate. Now, give me a hand. I'd put it back. Just so they don't know how I escaped. Always cover your tracks, guys. If you're gonna do something sketch like this, cover your tracks. Put it back, make it look like it wasn't broken. Then they're like, oh, how did he get out? We don't know, but now they know. Not that it matters though, I guess I'll just kind of look for you anyways, but at least they'll always wonder. Yo, I'd say we just bounce, bro. Why are we even here still? What's all that noise? Uh -oh. It's a herd. They've got this place surrounded. Come on. Uh -oh. this Clever. Way. Clever by the game developers. Now we can't leave. Where are you taking me? Eleanor found a place. Gabe's there with the others. We've been hiding out there. For as long as we can, anyway. How safe is it? Safe enough, for now. But we should hit the road as soon as we can. We should probably keep moving. Yeah, didn't you learn your lesson the first time? Where are the patrols? Oh, they're around. I had some close calls on my way to find you. Almost got caught, but I got lucky. You must be feeling better if you're sneaking around like this. I'm not, really, but I'll get my rest when we're safe. All clear. Come on. I saw them take David from the quarantine building. Yeah. How's he doing? I can't be his wife anymore. But he doesn't deserve to be locked away. I didn't tell him anything about how you feel. He's going to figure it out eventually. Maybe. But he's busy with more important things right now. Oh, God. Hold up. I think it's clear. Let's move. Okay, lead the way. There's not very many patrols. I thought there'd be more people. There's not. Oh my 
god, she found a graveyard. Nice boomers. They're gonna be looking for you soon. It's only a matter of time before they find the room empty and sound the alarm. They can keep looking because we're gonna be out of Richmond soon. Not soon enough. That's Eleanor's place. Uh -oh. There's a lot of activity all of a sudden. I don't like this. Come on. Let's get inside. It's probably because of all the fucking uh, zombies outside. I would definitely have a lot of people on the streets if there was a horde outside my community. It would be pointless to have your soldiers inside chilling. I mean, what the fuck are they gonna do? Fight zombies inside? That wouldn't make any sense. Ah, uh, that's why the activity is going. She's gonna make a statement. I really don't think now is the time though, especially if you have a, a huge threat just outside your walls. I kind of feel like this would be a pointless activity at this point. But I guess I have so much faith in their walls that they're not worried about what's happening outside. Very ballsy of the room. simple is or what it means. If it even has any like actual meaning. Stuff like the American flag so many years later too they haven't forgotten. Someone is going to die, probably a lot of people actually. Now, I've been thinking hard about this and I really think we should be a thing. I'm sorry. I don't know if I feel like that. That way. Hey, buddy. It's good to see you, Avi. Really? Your goofy face and everything. I didn't expect to find you here. I mean, Kate said you were here, but I thought... I went looking for my dad, but I couldn't find him. I just can't do this now. Oh. Hey. Uh, hey. Trip, look who's here. Hey, guys. Uh, hey. <clears throat> Where have you been? Joan threw me and David in jail, if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. What is going on here in Richmond? You know more about this place than the rest of us. What do we do? Joan lied. She's trying to remove David from power. Told you we couldn't trust him. I want to go save my dad. Right now. He needs our help. No way. It's just too dangerous. The best thing for our family is to get out of here. Of course you'd say that. You already tried running away once. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Don't get shot now. Be incognito. Conspicuous and shit. Or we'll just left the whole blind oh. up. Holy shit. Now that's a problem. Javi, 
Even if you did get your brother free, you're not going to be able to go anywhere. Wow. As much as I don't want to be here... You sure are glad we didn't stumble into that on our own? <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. Good lord. Can you imagine? Would have been worth risking it to get away from all this. Be able to start fresh. You and me. That's brave. Stupid. But brave. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. We'll need to make sure we can defend ourselves. No matter what we do next, okay? Defend? That's all you're doing? I don't want to risk us losing anybody else. But you don't seem to mind that. I know where there's guns. What? My dad showed me. There are lots. I can take us. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. Yo, she just attacked me and now she wants a hug? What the fuck, Kate? All I was saying Look, is... Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but... I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I, about that, I, I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just not right. I know you must have at least heard something. It happens, especially these days. Don't worry about it. Thanks. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on! Just give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just I don't know what to do. Just follow your heart. That's all any of us have left anymore, right? Thanks, man. I like you, Trip. I'll talk it over with Eleanor and watch over things here. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on! Good luck. Yo, kid, calm down. Holy smokes. Trip needed some dating advice, okay? I'm clearly the man for the job. I landed my brother's wife. Who can say that they've done that? Hopefully not a lot of people. Stay alert. Be careful. You'll be fine. Okay. This'll be great. We got this. Slow down, buddy. I've done this before, Hobbs. <coughs> no, you haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second, and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? What do you mean, Hobby? Just be careful. People aren't muertos. They can shoot at you. I know. Then you know to be quiet and stay hidden. That guy looks like an Instagram filter. One of the Disney Instagram filters. So... We stay hidden and quiet? If we could just slip past quietly, it'll make our job a lot easier. Okay. We don't want to make any noise and attract any attention. Hey, I can go talk to him while you sneak inside. I'll distract him. You won't do anything to me. It's a good idea, Gabe. I, I can do this. Hey! Oh, hey. I saw something. Show me. Nice job. I don't think I would have used that approach, but nice job. I probably would have been like, hey, can you show me where the council's having their meeting, please? 
Step into the sheet and point to it. Uh oh. Metal detector. Oh, he walked right through it. Where am I? I wonder what this building used to be. Probably a government building if it's uh, got a metal detector. <sighs> Told you it would work. Good work, buddy. Yeah, what happened to the guard, though? It's down here. The guns are through that door. It's a post office. Locked. No time to look for a key either. Yeah, it was a government building. I have to do this the hard way. Oh, so much for not making it this far. God, listen to that. around bro they kept the guns look at this if you could disarm these people it's my bat what up if you could disarm this community they are fucking boned dude i would take everything even if there wasn't ammo for it i'd still take it put these in your bag We've never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle nephew one two punch. It's not over yet. We need to keep our heads in the game. Ah, you're right. Uh. Drop it. What the hell are you doing here? What are you doing with all that? We're trapped here in town. There's a herd at the gates. No matter what's going on out there, I need to be able to protect my family. Javier, that herd is the least of your fucking problems right now. It was a shit thing to do, fucking off on me like that. I know. I... Why didn't you meet me at the stronghold? We had a plan. I just can't be a part of what's going on in New Richmond. The lying and the stealing. You sound just like your brother. I know he'd want me to help you, no matter what. But why should I trust you now? As far as I can tell, you're nothing but trouble. Yeah. We need you. A lot more than you need us, I know, but we need you. That's about the most pathetic plea I've ever heard. <laughs> you're lucky I've got a thing for underdogs. Okay. You know I'm in. And it looks like you could use all the help you can get. Awesome. I gotta grab something else real quick. Meet me by the front at five. Okay. I don't remember betraying her. What? Wait, where's the bags? The boy has the bags? They took one bag. Why? Uh-oh. Dude, we gotta fuck this guy up. Come here. your back, dude. Freeze! Get away from me! I don't understand. Why wouldn't you draw your fucking back? Guess 
not supposed to get stabbed. <clears throat> Javi, you're bleeding. Oh, Are you okay? Oh my god. God damn it, Gabe. Does it fucking look like I'm okay? Oh, I'm sorry. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so he sees him. Strip him naked so he won't leave. That's what I would do. You don't have to kill him, but you can take all his clothes and throw them around the vicinity. Oh, I need to move. Then he won't leave and he becomes a... An Let me see number. that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facilities right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay, but let's be quick. I probably wouldn't leave that next day either, if I'm honest. Because when that guy wakes up, he's just going to grab the weapon and keep rolling. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? So now there's two bags? Earlier there was one bag that he was holding. This guy is fucked. Clem? <gasps> Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Looking for something? Sort of. I know this looks bad, but it's not like... It's not like what? I'm just here to talk to Lingard about where AJ is now. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. He's breathing you, dude. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. All right. Go for it. But if I lose my arm, that's on you. Ha ha. You'll be fine. I've dealt with worse. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. <clears throat> Clem. Are you okay? I'm fine. I started bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. It means you're growing up, blossoming into your, you know, like, womanhood. Your body is, is developing, and then things change, but it, it'll be okay. Okay. <clears throat> Why did you just say to I can period? take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi. I don't understand why guys get so weird about talking about, like, periods. Like, he just had to say, bro, it's your period. It's what happens when you hit puberty. It's normal. You're Gucci. Just keep that shit clean. You'll be fine. Worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. Oh, man. Seriously, you say we need to, and you stand there looking at that fucking druggy. Oh, man. Getting stabbed is not good. Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. Isn't penicillin for an STD? But also. Cody. Hmm. Not much left. I don't know. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take that, so... I don't really care. Well, these could come in handy. 
fuck these guys. They're going down anyway, so what does it matter? Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. And this capsule bottle. <sighs> Just pills. In the apocalypse, I wouldn't turn a blind eye to any kind Here of... Here we go. There you go. Why he has tampons in his lab, I don't know. Or pads, but that's fine. It's not for me to ask. You know, it's his business. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. Now you took care of me. I think I remember how to do this. Oh God. <sighs> okay. Hold still. Right, Try you... not to breathe. You ripped the shit, bro. Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. <sighs> you weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Even Ava would have to admit, I was a good mom to AJ. Damn, the cutscenes are deep with this episode. <laughs> Whoa there, Clem. It's just me. What the hell do you want? I know how pissed you are, Clementine. Spitting on David really got that message across. Believe it or not, I'm actually sorry about what happened. It wasn't easy for any of us. You have to believe that. I'm going to get AJ back. You can't keep me away forever. That's just not going to happen, Clem. Look, it's not much, but here. Every time they fucking give me shit, it's in a fucking bag. Is this the only kind of bags this universe has? Tootsie... Tootsie brand chili? Ew, dude. Energy bar, Major's doodle, bottle of water. David wanted you to have that. AJ drew it just after you... It calmed him down. This... Thank you. You're welcome. Consider it a peace offering? Fuck no. We care about you. Just try to remember that even if it feels wrong, people can still be trying to do the right thing by you. Listen, it's dangerous out here and right now... You're hurting. Whatever you do, you can't let what happened get to you. You need to keep a level head. Plan for after that. You're strong, but that won't get you far if you don't know what you're doing. Or where you're headed. Oh, I'll keep fighting. 
You guys gave me no other choice. It's not time for that anymore, Clem. Your focus has to be on you now. That's all you can do. For me, staying alive has always been about finding people I could trust as much as they trusted me. That's what the new frontier has been. A silver lining. Made me feel worth a damn. Kept me going in the worst of times. You'll find yours. I know you will. Someone or something. You people stole mine. You know that. You'll just have to find something new that... Shut the hell up! From the first time we met, right here, surrounded by absolute hell, you and AJ were a light in the darkness. Hope for a better world. That's who you are. Promise me you'll never lose that light. Please. It's what makes you special, Clem. Okay, I promise. You're a tough kid. Don't change. <sighs> I should get back before anyone notices I'm gone. Remember to keep the focus on you now, Clem. And when you need a little extra support, there's an old airfield about 10 or so miles south of here. Prescott. There are good people there. I'm sure they'll help you out. I'll miss having you around, Clem. <clears throat> Shake her hand or tell her to leave. I mean, she's not a bad person. You're going to be okay. Thanks, Ava. Good luck out there, Clem. It's not her that's the problem. She's actually a pretty decent person. So she works for. Her. That's what keeps me going. There's things I have to stay alive to do. So, what do you think? I think I'm getting better. Nice work. Thanks. Just glad I could help. <clears throat> you coming? I still have to ask Lingard about AJ. <sighs> Let's wake his ass up and smack him. Hello, Clementine. Javier, thought you were rotting in a cell with David. There any chance he got out too? I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. Joan took him before I got out. I haven't seen him since. That poor bastard. He's... He's not getting out. Guess there's only one sure way to get away from Joan these days. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. If you think that, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered, David was the one who stepped up. Took personal responsibility for that kid. You say that like it's a good thing. I really doubt he was a positive influence. David's the reason the kid's better off now than he's ever been. You can be as mad as you want about how, about how things panned out. Clem is AJ's family. No kid is better off when you break their family apart. Maybe you're right. Maybe AJ should be with Clem. All I know is that he's better than he was when he got here. No thanks to you or David. I stand by what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then. You... You want to know where the boy is? No shit, dickhead. What do you want? I... I just want to die. Wow. I want you to inject this into me. Are you crazy? That's just the way it is. When your brother found me, he... He got me to care about everything I'd given up on. 
my life. Other people. Even this goddamn place. Without him around. I don't want to care anymore. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. to know. I've right. been looking for too long. Then he dies. All right. I'll do it. He looks like a fucking clown. Well, where is he? He's... He's at the McCarroll Ranch. A few miles west of here. He's really alive. Have a good life. Don't forget to stick around to handle the after part. I don't want to become one of those monsters. Don't forget, John's looking for you and your friends. You better hope she doesn't find you. Such a waste, man. I've got it. Well, why should I? Why should I not let him turn? He is nothing good. I don't think I should stab him. Do I have an option to back out of this? Yep, I do. Yeah. Oh god, she's went straight for the head! Oh, hey. I guess you have to. Uh, hi, Clementine. Surprised to see you here. Yeah, right back at you. You all good? Yeah, we're all set. Let's roll. Mm, good to see you. Yeah, shut up, take it, keep moving. You're back! And Clementine. Thanks for the warm welcome. Just surprised to see you is all. Guys, this is Ava. Oh She's... yeah, I know who she is. She's got a hell of a punch. Nice to meet you. Good to see you, Ava. Oh, hell. You okay? Yeah. It looks worse than it is. Don't worry about it. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. So you got the guns, huh? We got them, all right. One for you, and one for you. I saved this one for you. No, I've already got one. Wrecked. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. Thanks. What took you so long? We went to see Dr. Lingard. At night? I'm kind of surprised he was sober. It's got to be a stressful job, looking after an entire community. Actually, Lingard's dead. Oh my god. He asked me to help him end it, so I helped him. I... I had no idea things had gotten that bad for him. He was done with all this. Why don't you go talk to Kate, okay? Okay. Right, she's resting. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Okay, Ava. Jones people know we're holed up here, and they're gonna come looking for us. All of us. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think, fucking figures. And there's no going anywhere with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Just cause they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the rest of us. We're sitting ducks up here. Hey, we can do this! Yeah! We've gotten out of tougher jams before, haven't we? I mean, sure. But this is different. We can't just cut and run. Not with the herd out there. Like it or not, 
we're fucking stuck in Richmond. Now, how the fuck are we gonna put the brakes on this thing? Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. Great. So, how do we do that? It's a good question. Joan will probably have a full security detail with her. She'll be insulated from us and from anybody in Richmond who doesn't agree with what she's doing. If there are good people left in Richmond who are against what Joan's doing, we need to ask for their help. If we can talk to the people at the trial, present the case to everyone in Richmond, we might not have to do this on our own. We light the match, the people do the rest. After we take Joan out, we're gonna need some way out of this mess. Now, I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck, a big one, that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are gonna be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been expanding, pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but that's where the truck's parked. <laughs> I could spit and hit it. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Steal what? Hey. Jesus, Javi, is that blood on your shirt? You said it wasn't that bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? Oh, you're bleeding right through that bandage. You should have told me as soon as you got in. It was Gabe's fault. Why don't you ask him what happened out there? I was just doing what had to be done. I'm the one who tells you what to do, not the other way around. We got it stitched up. It's fine. Thought you knew what you were doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, can you take a look at this? As long as he keeps it clean, it should be okay. Would you guys stop making such a big deal about it? Shut up. It happened. It's over. Move on already. I'm just trying to make sure he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. Oh, I have a bunch of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Yeah. Just like a good give idea. me a gun and I'll do whatever. I know the town. I know what Dad's going to be thinking. It's not a bad place to start. And it's good you want to help. We've got to talk it through before we settle on anything. Just as long as I get to come along. Not that I don't appreciate the can-do attitude, but I don't know if you're invited, little man. I think I agree with Trip. Ugh, this is bullshit! I'm not staying behind. Gabe, take a breath. He's my dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there, and I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for. This is more important to me than anyone else. I've got a gun, and I know how to use it. No way anybody is dying. Not today. That's why we have to take the time to talk it through, so everybody comes out okay. Nobody here is gonna let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Mm. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Wow. Back in the tunnel, when he came after us, he tried to bargain with you, but you thought killing him would be easier. You little fucking asshole! You don't scare me. You shot him. You killed him. What the fuck, Javi? Is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eyes, man. You let me think the walkers had killed him. He had a gun on them. If I hadn't killed him, he was going to shoot Clementine and Gabe. He's telling the truth. When Conrad found out that I used to run with New Frontier, he went crazy. He would have pulled the trigger, no question. I guess we'll never know, right? Because he's not here to tell his side of things. You made sure of that. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? <laughs> I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You yeah. feel me? We can take care of ourselves. Hell, we stick around you much longer. You'll probably kill us too. Okay. I'm leaving. I wouldn't want to be around me right now either. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. 
Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. Why is he coming with? Are you... No. No, no. No, 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 no. That little fucker needs to stay with Trip. Oh my gosh, dude. Are you serious? You come with me to get the truck. Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. Can I not just like turn around and swing my bat at his head? I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did, right? You're right. Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. You proved your fucking point already, Gabe. Now it's time to grow up and help us. Hey, Gabe. Come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Yeah. Okay. I guess somebody needs to be a lookout. What? Nothing. Gabe and I will be fine back here. She like him? I think she likes him. No, I want him to go. Oh, I genuinely, I want him to go. What do you want, Javi? Let's talk later. <sighs> All right. <clears throat> You're a little fucker, dude. And if time comes. You're on your own. I'm not helping you. There's a lot of stuff to look at. Yeah, turn that off, too. Gotta be careful. Any more muertos pushing? Those boards won't hold up. How heavy are those things? Are they? Do they weigh? Do they weigh like 300 pounds a, a corpse? It's like skin and bone on those fucking things. Hmm. This thing looks like it moves too slow for an escape. Yeah, that's true. What's going on? Thanks. For what? Helping out with Gabe. He's having a rough time. Yeah, we all are. I'm just doing what I can. Let's keep looking for that truck. You got it. Okay, I don't really care about all this heavy machinery. It's not gonna help me. What's gonna help me is this. There it is. Let's go. Um, always have a bad feeling about garages, you know? What are the chances? I'd say about 50-50. Smart ass. They say I'm all Graveyard shift is killing me. Oh, let me get some of that. Early risers. Come on, we gotta hurry and finish before more people wake up. What are we gonna do? I'm gonna send you into I can't start the engine. Not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. She's Ready? Injured. Ready. It would make sense Ready. that she would be the steerer. Let's push, peeps. Yo, I 
I'll spam the shit out of that. That's a heavy ass chop. Turns out you needed me after all, huh? Not really, no. I'm just saying, I know you didn't want me to come along. Just push the damn truck. All right? What do you think I'm doing? I'm doing all the work. You're the one trying to have a conversation here. <laughs> That's more like it. <laughs> oh, God. That's a Don't definite. think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. I put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Uh, do I know how? Try not to shock yourself. God, this is gonna be the worst. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? No, I'm going... This That's a fucking money truck. That's an almond money truck. Wonder. Ah, lovely. Now a zombie's gonna grab me through the fence. The stripper's right there. Oh, oh some respect, zombie. Almost there. Keep an eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Here goes. Don't worry, boys. I'm basically a professional at this. I'm doing it my whole life. All right. Wire cutter should help with this. So we have ignition wire. We have battery wire. Got to connect the battery to the ignition. That's right. Use this. Let there be light. That's not good. I probably would have stripped them off first. Oh shit. I couldn't read what that said. What did that say? Abby, hurry up! I'm hurrying, dude. Calm down. Don't get electrocuted. Power. Don't get electrocuted. blocks away. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? No, I'm not about to turn the engine off again. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. That's not a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Really takes you back, doesn't it? Just you and me and Gabe and Mari. Better times. You're right. This is nice. Like if I just close my eyes, we're right back where we were. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff. Not everything that happened after. <laughs> Gotcha. Oh, come on. That's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. He like likes her. You get it? Well, okay, I sort of am. As long as it doesn't go anywhere. 
Come on. You're saying you don't think they're adorable together. It's complicated, kid. Clem's got history. We've all got history, Javi. Every single one of us. It's so normal, you know? Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet. But to feel something that intensely for another person? Hey, the falling in love is the easy part. It's the staying in love part that'll really mess you up. It's unfair, that's all I'm saying. That they're feeling what they're feeling right now, and when that sun gets a little higher, it's right back to the fight. <sighs> I just wish he could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. They deserved better than this. That's why we're doing this thing, right? So he can have a better life after everything's said and done? You're right. I know you're right. I hope you know, Javi. Having you there with me, right by my side, all this time. That's what made the difference. Wow. You're so sure of what you're doing all this for. You didn't run away. You could have. I think that's just you know, who I am, you know? Uh, who I am now, at least. I get it. There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. I know we've had moments, you and I. And there are always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all <laughs> but before whatever happens tomorrow happens i need you to know whatever this thing is between us i want to give it a chance and i know the fact that david is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated but do you feel the same way i'd really like to know before things get crazy let's go for it we gotta try right oh my god really really so are we gonna okay yeah shit we're doing this you do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, right? It's the right way to play this. He already got the sense I was pulling away. I just want to be able to tell him in person. It'll feel better that way. That would be the stand-up thing to do in this situation. Can I just say how lame doing the stand-up thing is, though? Oh, it's super lame. Javi, it's an execution over here. She's planning to hang David in front of the whole crowd. You've got to get over here, now! Don't bring the truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. If you can just get into the square... Shit. We got to get over there. Now! soon as we've got David. Good luck. I love the kissing sound. <laughs> Nothing else from Ava? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. It sounded like Ava got cut off by something. Or somebody. They're just gonna stand in the truck. Fields. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. Wait, where did the zombies go? Are they... Oh, they... Like, is the whole plan shot? Or did she just have a little setback? I hate not knowing. We can't get distracted. I don't know what happened on the other side, but it doesn't change what we have to do. Now confused, okay? So they went to a... They went to a garage. Oh, uh, you know why? Because she said that the, uh... The area... 
was cleared, but she wasn't cleared. She wasn't sure if it was cleared of walkers. Okay, so we're still I in just wish town. we had a little more information. That's all. We're, in an we're not gonna know area. what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So let's do it already. Right, you ready? Dead. We just have to remember, we're people, not muertos. We're smarter than they are, and we need to act like it. Exactly. We've got to take the time to think things through. Yeah, for a minute I was like, how the hell did they get the truck into the city again? But then it's kind of like, well, they never ever left. If I had the option, I'd just bounce and be like, peace, fuck you guys. I'd just kick Gabe out the door and let him rescue his dad. He does. Shit. We can't wait for the others, can we? For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle. Strong council, strong community. But, unfortunately, the actions of one of the members of that council, our security expert, David Garcia, have put us all She's in... lying to all of you! I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. Just look what he's done. He murdered these men in cold blood. I saw him murder Lonnie with my own eyes. Some of the best men I ever knew cut down in their prime. Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless? This cruel? Not if I have anything to do with it. I can't believe this is really happening. She's gonna kill him. She can't do this to him. He's kept him safe. I think she's bluffing. It's a scare tactic. There's no way she's really gonna execute David. Are you sure? I hope you're right. Javier! I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why did you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people would like to hear what you have to say. Why should I, huh? What are you after? You think I'm trying to pull a fast one on you? She knows we're here now. We might as well. We both know you killed Dr. Lingard. Why, Javi? Why would you do that to us? The only surgeon in a hundred mile radius, but you didn't care about that. Dr. Lingard had a problem. He couldn't stay out of his own supply. He asked me to put him out of his misery. I was only doing what he wanted. Sorry if I don't take your word for it. Too bad you killed the only man who could back up your story. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend, Eleanor, last night. She was the one who alerted us to David's plot against Lingard. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. She said you were coming here to rally the people against me. Convince them that I was no good for Richmond. Don't know how you thought you were going to pull it off, considering it's all of us, against the three of you. And that's exactly what I'm planning to do. Appreciate the honesty, which makes this so much harder. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me. You're making a mistake. Ava! Oh no, they had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. Oh, he told fuck. his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? I can't just let it go. You've put me in a no-win situation here, so I'm going to do the same thing to you. Both of them deserve to die for their crime. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. No! Hell no! Jones! Don't! 
not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this, but they chose to go along with it. Is this the kind of leadership you got in store for Richmond? Torturing people with your stupid power games? Justice isn't a game, Javi. It's about time you learn that. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? All eyes are on you. Maybe this will help you make up your mind. Boys? Oh, kill him, for sure. Come on, Javi. Who's it gonna be? Your friend? Or your brother's lieutenant? Uh, let's save Trip. Trip has to live. He's invaluable. Son of a bitch. Javi, what the fuck is wrong with you? You're not making David happy. But I respect you for sticking up for your own people. Shoot him. Wait! I said Trip should live! You did, but there's something else you need to understand. Betrayal. You can't do this! Fucking figures. I can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. You can't... No. No. no! Would he have died oh irrespective? They really shot him. Oh, God damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. The guy in the back's all like, woo, yeah. I can't believe this. This isn't how we do things. This is madness! You're pathetic, Clint. We trusted the process, and look where we are. You're right. Think about this, Javi. You know what's gonna happen here. You ready for that? I am. We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond, and then whatever you do, it's up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody, put your guns away. We're gonna handle this peacefully. Don't listen to them, Javi. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch. Take her out. She deserves it. We're leaving. All of us. Right now. I didn't say you could go. Doesn't matter if you did. This is how it needs to happen. and I kill him. I swear I will. Go ahead and shoot then. I warned you. They can't be trusted. What the fuck? I had this under control. Now you're fucking everything up. Sorry, little brother. She's not gonna win. I can't let her. Oh god, they're icing their own fucking people. Are you kidding me? Rapid pace situation. Oh, clap, bro. Fucking hag! Get back here! Okay, I need you to cover me. We gotta make things right. Okay. What about Ava? She's right there. Dad needs us. We gotta get out there. David's trained for this. We're not. You think he'll be okay out there? I've got no doubts. Actually, can I die and redo that?
<laughs> it's just a fucking fell backwards. I want him to go. Oh, stay out. Oh no. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. I fucked up. Hang on. Uh, main menu. Alright, I'm doing this a different way. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just cannot. I cannot let this guy live. I just cannot. I don't know if I'm actually going to get the opportunity to do this again. We'll see. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's see how far back this will take us. Continue episode four. Oh no. What the fuck? Is this? She's I. It's an armored truck. Jade! She's fine, bro. She's fine. That was a gas line, though. Get up, Javier. Why are you still She's just gonna have to live. I think I did say at the beginning of the walkthrough I was gonna like live with the decisions I made, but yeah, kind of blows. Kind of wish I could have gone back on that decision. It's the only decision I've ever made in this game that I wish I could have gone back on. So far, this is pretty crazy, though. I guess Gabe lives. Everything, everything so far has gone according to my plan, though. I wanted to get with, I wanted to betray David, uh, kill David, kill Gabe. Um, I don't think David would have let Gabe die, though. I really don't. Previously on The Walking Dead. Okay, since we're doing, since we're doing this back to back episode, can I just skip this? Whatever this thing is between us okay good start i want to give it a chance and i know the fact that david is back in our lives now makes this 
whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? I'm in. All the way. Oh my god, really? Really. Just look what he's done. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. You've put me in a no-win situation here. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. Trip has to live. Shoot him. Wait! I said Trip should live! No! How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? We're leaving. All of us. Right now. It's Kate. She's coming for us. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Kate! Oh, actually, I looked, just checked the time, it's getting a little late, yeah. I thought I could pull a double, but obviously, since I've been going for an hour and 32 minutes, it's not going to happen. Um, but we'll pick up on the next one, I think. I'll, uh, I'll post them all together, so that way it's back-to-back, -back and there's no really delay behind any of them. So, I'll have them up tomorrow, I'll have the next one recorded tomorrow, and it should be all up tomorrow end of the season tomorrow so i honestly appreciate it guys and i will see you guys in the next one peace